I can't stand when people leave their K cups in the machine. I don't know if that's just me. If you have a problem with it too, leave it in the comments down below. But um, anyway, let's get into story time. Speaking of coffee machines, this reminds me of back when I was at my first job about 20 years ago. I worked as a machinist and there was a little break room where everybody kept all of their stuff, microwave, coffee maker, whatever you wanted to use to fix your food or fix your lunch or whatever. It was kept in a little break room. Nobody messed with anybody else's stuff. But this particular day, I was working on night shift at the time. Somebody thought it was funny, or somebody thought it would be funny on the day shift to take my little George Foreman grill that I used to cook every day with. Pieces of meat on. Close the machine down. There's no need to mash. The machine has a little lever that constantly presses down and cooks the meat the way it needs to be cooked. You put the drain pan and watch. See that? Knock out the fat. Do the thing and you do it right and you don't fuck it up, it works. It just works. To take my little George Foreman grill that I used to cook every day with and hide it. And of course, I didn't initially believe that it was hidden. I thought it was stolen at first, which made me flip out because I can't stand thieves. I can't stand having things stolen. It's just, it's a real, real hot spot for me. So, I get in at night shift. I cannot find my George Foreman grill, and I go that entire evening looking for it and cannot find it. Towards the end, I realized that it was some type of... um prank that was being pulled on me and so I figured okay I've got something for day shift they want to they want to prank me all of a sudden I, I'll fire back yeah that next morning they couldn't find their coffee machine yeah it wasn't funny then because I remember being at home and uh I get a phone call maybe like nine ten o'clock in the morning and it's uh and it's the it was the foreman or the supervisor, but he was like, Dennis, Dennis, I gotta I gotta ask you, did you um did you do something to the um did you do something with the coffee machine? And I'm like, what, what are you talking about? What what coffee machine? It's like, come on, Dennis, the guys here, they're they're losing it, man. They're they're ready to hang you, man, cause uh this coffee machine, you you know, you don't you don't mess with a person's coffee. It's like, yeah, you don't mess with my grill either. I said that over the phone. I told him where the coffee machine is. I told him where it was. But they knew better than to mess with me again. And, and, and they were mad. When I, got, when I got into night shift the next day, there were people that were like seriously angry with me. But they knew that they had crossed the line by messing with my grill. I fix hot dogs every day. You don't mess with a black man's grill. I'll see y'all tomorrow. <laughs>